Welcome back, all you heroes and ghouls, and we are continuing a cotillion where uh, here in the future, the whole of the elven forest is now burning. Oh, God. And everyone seems to be panicking. Mm. Oh, all right. John's <laughs> John's face is like, oh. <laughs> Ulare, take these two to the waterfall. Stay in the river until we get this taken care of. Okay, John, thank you. Oh, cool. All right. Nice. So we went ahead and got things kind of squared off with that. Yay, we're helping. They couldn't think to do that on their own. They needed the non-magic baby to... Yeah, it's fine. Uh-oh. Someone's down. This one's dead. Let's keep moving. Oh, God. Already? That's not good. Oh, well, I just... Uh, it'd be naive to assume that everyone would make it out of this alive, right? So, okay. What do we have here? The shopkeeper. John, you came for us! Everyone's going down to the river. You'll be safe from the fire there. All right, John. Come on, you. Pull yourself together. Okay, and those two are gone now. Awesome. Well, then... I guess that's that. The door is jammed. Cool. Uh, we don't need Mitchell getting distracted in the pub anyway. I'm sure Jonathan Ill has everything under control at his place. We need to check on everyone else. Okay, so checking on everyone is what I was supposed to be doing anyway. So good. Oh, well, uh, you're having a bad day. Nope. Nothing I can do with you? Okay, well, I guess you're just dead then. Oh, well, sad. Sucks to be you. You, shopkeeper, are you here to save us? My, um, <clears throat> whoa, I got, like, text in there for a second. Mm. Okay, hold on, let me try to clear my throat. <clears throat> my, um, <sighs> no, wow, no, I'm still, no I can't say ma'am in my Sean Connery voice, weird. <laughs> We're sending everyone to the river. You'll be safe there until the fire dies down, ma'am. Wow, why can't I say the word ma'am? That's so weird. Hey, you're John Poem, aren't you? How do you know? I never come in here. I've got something for you. Lixis had me enchant this weapon a while ago. She wanted to give it to you, but I guess you need it now. Storm Crusher! All right! Ooh, wait, hold on. Let me double check on something. Ooh, hey, the... I haven't been recording the audio of the game. But... I should be recording it now? No? Yes? Maybe? Hold on. Let me... Let me kind of stop and start this here. I'll be right back. Okay, so we went ahead and fixed that issue. So let's pull on up here and see what we've got for John's ultimate storm crusher. That is definitely a big upgrade for sure. Yeah, doesn't seem to be an item description, but a lot of these late game items don't seem to have one. Alright, well that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Let's uh, go on through here and... Maybe... Storm Crusher, bring her back to life! <laughs> slash, slash, slash. Alright, I guess we're heading on up here now. Oh, hole, holes. Holes are fine. Yeah, alright, cool. And... Uh, I just want to make sure... Let's let's do a little bit of healing. Nope, that's not what I wanted. You can do a little bit of healing for everybody. Just uh, just some mend, a little bit of mend, just because I want everyone to be at their maximum for this. Here we go. And so we've got uh, a couple leftovers. Oh, you, hey, you're around. You didn't uh, die with uh, the desert town. That's good. Mm. It's good to see you again, John. Oh, that's all you have to say? Cool. Lixis. John, you came back for us. Kitty face. All right, well. Yanathan Hill. John, you've come as I knew you would. Yanathan Hill, we can talk later. We need to get you to the river. Indeed. You will be right behind us, yes? Master Jonathan Hill, please. We will do what we can to stop this, but we need to make sure you and your people are safe. Ah, Mika. 
I haven't seen you here in nearly two centuries. Yana, go! <laughs> That's right. So now, I have a feeling... Here, let's do a quick save. Because now that John's got his upgraded ultra weapon, I'm sure we're going to have to face a beastie from the... Yep, there we go. Ooh, look at this fire demon. Everything's got a red shift right now. Ignis. All right, all right. I can be uh, be down for Ignis. Let's unleash the tsunami, because there's no way you are not weak to water. <laughs> John, go ahead and study it. Stenobar, you can do your... No, guard. Yeah, not guard. Uh, hyper barrier with everybody. Okay, Byron, you are going to... Uh, we're, we're fine, just do a regular attack. Mika, uh, we got 29 toxic arrows, which is awesome, and 36 poison arrows. But let's go with a, a poison arrow for here. Alright, study! Ignis! Yep, 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 the same as all these other guys uh, with the weak to water, resist to ice, absorb fire, yes. That's exactly as I expected. Tsunami! Yeah, that's what we like to see. And you're poisoned now, bitch. Okay, hyper barriers up, so we got no nothing to worry about. That flare did nothing. Come on, let's hit him with another Johnny tsunami. <laughs> All right, rage mode. Now, Stenobar, you can attack. Byron, you can attack, and Mika, you can normal arrow shot. Rage. You're burning down my home! <laughs> but of course, the real, the real big person here is Alicia, because no one else... Ooh, recovering the arrow is always good. Because, of course, there's there's just no one who can... Oh, God, yeah, the, he's so freaking... He's, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. You know what? Byron... Let's see the fury attack, just because I want to. <laughs> oh, man. None of these uh, endgame bosses are doing anything. My my whole group has been, like, severely overpowered for quite some time with uh, the notable... <laughs> the, 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 no, the notable... Brain function dying... With the notable uh, front runner being Alicia, she just dominates everything. Oh my God! There's not even any competition. Wow! Why did it take me so long to think of those words? That's I feel bad. That was dumb, 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 dumb. Okay, let's get everyone. All right. Oh hey, we got these bats again. All right. Well, let's just uh, waterfall them. And then everyone do regular attacks. And we'll see how things go from there. Yeah, slash, slash, waterfall! And I'm going to take a... Oh, yeah, they did not, in fact, die from that. Hmm. I've, it's been about two weeks since I've recorded. So, they are, uh, I, I forgot that these giant fire bats are actually really tough <laughs> so yeah but it's nothing we can't handle right guys now unleash the power yeah you you guys are so done boom dead error recovered always like seeing that error recover because I hate spending money Hurricane Slash! Excellent! Is that the ultimate wind attack? I'll bet that's the ultimate wind attack. 850! All enemies are slashed with debris at incredible speeds. Good god, that is so expensive! Whoa! John, you did great! Well, I didn't do much. My friends did most of the work. Hmm. Meh. 
If you didn't miss it, it could me, 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 me. No. Your friends did not do most of the work. Alicia did most of the work. Get it right, John. <laughs> she did everything, as she always does. Nonsense, John. You saved the village. If you hadn't shown up when you did, we'd all be dead. Yana, what can be done about the fire? Ah, Mika, it is good to see you again. The flames can be dealt with, but the damage has been done. I'm afraid we're going to abandon Galifanor. Er, Galfalenor. Galfalenor. Galfalenor, for the time being. We can take you someplace safe. We should be able to fit all of you in the airship. Whoa. The monsters are attacking almost every settlement in the world in both time periods. The only relatively safe place left is Nofum, or the de dwarven city under the Kamir Raskin Desert. Perhaps it isn't under attack because it's underground. That's perfect. We can take you all there. Yes, that seems like the safest place for us. Relations between our people and the dwarves have always been pleasant. I am sure no full goods take good care of y'all. Excellent. John, lead the way to the airship. Alright! So now we we uh, evacuated the elves into no, no Faug. So now, dwarves and elves will be living together in blissful harmony. Thank you for saving us. Good to see you again. It's locked. Uh, here's the dwarf kids. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Don't care. Yeah, sure you do. Sure you do, kid. Okay. And this chick is still passed out on the floor. Um, memories come back to me. Memories of not remembering the night after. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I feel like there's... Mm, She's just been passed out there this whole time. I feel like at some point I'm going to be able to do something with her. But maybe I'm just making stuff up in my own mind and it's never going to happen. Uh, okay, yes, the dwarf who thinks that we're giants. Um, shopkeeper. Uh, yes, having trouble with your stock. Well, I mean, you did have to move... <laughs> whole uh, continents, so I feel like that's okay. Uh, legendary Wizard's Cloak would uh, be quite good for Mika, so yeah. And quite good for Eliana, too. Okay, we'll take two of you. Nice. Uh, good for Eliana. Good for Mika. Oh yeah, absolutely. So yeah, we'll take two legendary wizard's hats as well. And the benediction looks like it's a huge increase to magic attack, but a huge decrease to regular attack for whatever she's got. And I don't even remember what she's got on her, so let's go ahead and get your change out your hood for the legendary hat, magical dwarven armor for the legendary cloak, and uh, da, da, do Eliana. Ah, Dragon Breath Flail is what you've got. I see, I see, yes. That's okay. That's fine, that's fine. You can keep that. Okay, Legendary Wizard's Hat. Legendary Wizard's Cloak. Excellent! Yes, 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 thank you. I know, you're, you're fine. Just deal with it, okay? Let's... Sell the Earth Splitter. Keep the other stuff. Sell you. And you and you. Excellent. Well, I'm glad that I came in here and checked. Since now we have a whole new magic shop in here. Uh, you have anything new? Champion's Blade is nothing even remotely close to good for anything. No, no, no. Okay, let's buy a bunch of toxic arrows uh 10 let's do 10 boom there we go 
And now Mika is going to be even more ungodly powerful with his hooty tooty point and shooty. <laughs> no, we're good. We're good. No, we don't need any of your armors. Uh, do I have any more strange ingots? I'm pretty sure I do. Dagger. Yes. Yeah, we can give that to friends. Here you go. Dagger of Destiny. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Friends. Dagger of Destiny is going to give you a holy and incredibly sharp and balanced dagger. You've never seen anything quite this well made. That is gorgeous. Oh, yes. Dagger of Destiny. Look at that. A big agility boost, too. Bam. Hey, I just noticed that Friends' hat is uh, can't be switched out. <laughs> it's it's locked. The most fabulous hat. Good. But his outfit can be switched out, so that's actually interesting. I wonder uh, why his hat is considered n uh, no touchy, but his outfit can be changed no problem. Very interesting. Because when I look at Friends, I think the entire ensemble is pretty iconic to his character. But that is just me, I suppose. Uh, anything going on in this inn up here? Nope. Cool. Well then. Uh, l well, let's go ahead and use it. Oh, John, you and your friends saved me from that horrible monster. There wasn't anyone in No Fog to run the inn, so I took it over. Business isn't booming. Hey, steak for free! Hell yeah! Hey, that beats using a tent, as long as, you know, I don't have the whole... Uh, uh, b -b -b the tent scenes anymore. I would still be using tents if I got more tent scenes, but I think I ran out of those. Oh, that item shop is closed. Alright, well, I'm glad that I uh, experienced more of uh, Nofaug. I'm hoping I pronounced that right. Nofaug. Nofaug! You know why there's... You, you know why they, they call it Nofaug? Because there's... Because they're underground. So they don't get no faug. <laughs> oh, I'm awful. I am so awful. Okay, time to find more civilization. Let's see, I've been here, right? I did this one. Yes. I am... I'm reasonably certain I did this. Yeah, I absolutely did this one. Okay. So then where else can I go? I want to take care of everything in the future first. And once I know I've done everything in the future, I'll go back to the past and do all the past stuff. Okay. Well then, I guess we are all set on that plane. Uh, anything over yonder? Nope. Like that, how we, there, there's this whole landmass right here that's disconnected from everything, but uh, it's got nothing going on. Uh, I, oh, I wonder if the uh, the old shopkeeper has anything new going on here in the fishing village. See if maybe something. No, wrong house. See if maybe something happened uh, in here while well, I've been adventuring. If you got anything new. Old man. Old man Jenkins. Nope. Nothing even a little bit. Hmm. Yeah, he just gives big discounts for buying really basic items. So, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. I was hoping that maybe he'd, like, gotten more things. Maybe that'd be a, su a suggestion, is that as time goes on, if you complete the old man quest, then he gets to put more stuff on things. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, that's the, that's where, that was Byron's house, right? Yeah, I'm like, reasonably sure. Okay, down here is a, I, I have been informed by the creators, down in this hole is a super uber bonus boss monster. So, 
We're gonna make sure we do everything except for the final boss battle before we go and attack that dude. Uh, what's here? Have I been here already? Yeah, I can't even go in that town anymore, so that's a surefire situation showing me that I've... Oh, okay, it's the Elf Village. Man, everything looks the same. That's, that's like one kind of complaint that I do have is that it, it is very difficult to tell where things are in relative to other in in the overworld the the big world map but fairly minor quabble uh, since everything's small the world is small enough that you can just kind of run around and eventually run into stuff so it's not that big of a deal. I think I've done everything in the future, actually, except for that bonus boss fight. So, time travel! Yeah, here we go. Alright. And, I'm actually gonna have to... Ooh, yeah, 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 there's the... That tent set up here with... Oh, hey, look at that! Yes, so I was already here before, but this didn't activate at that time, so now I can do something here. Unfortunately, guys, I do have to pause the episode real quick because, oh my god, I've been hit by a sudden emergency bathroom situation, so I will be right back. crisis averted, so let's just jump right back into things here. Looks like all the inhabitants of this camp either perished or escaped already. Either way, you still need to deal with the portal. Excellent. Well, let's do that then. Deal with the portal, deal with the... Oh, hey, there it is. Yo. Can I avoid you and not deal with you so that I can check out this? Nope. It's a no entry zone. Well then, I guess we're just gonna deal with it. Boom! Roar. I would save, but honestly, I don't feel like I have any issues. Frigis! Okay, well, you are absolutely gonna be weak to fire if I ever saw anything that was so fire weak. Whoa, okay, okay, I'm pushing buttons, I'm pushing buttons, I don't mean to. I accidentally full screened and then it threw me off. Okay, incinerate! John, uh, well, let's go ahead and you just go right into your rage mode. Stenobar, can you... Yeah, we can flame sword. We don't even need to hyper uh, guard our group. Barrier, hyper barrier our group. Byron, just hit it. Mika, poison arrow it, because we don't need to waste a toxic arrow on this. Come on, Alicia's gonna freaking annihilate it. Mm, Dr. Pepper, I love you so much. Oh, that actually did not do a super huge amount of damage like I was expecting. Ah, but that flame sword absolutely did. Very good, very good. So I guess I probably still have uh, a stronger fire spell coming, because there's that's only 200 EP, and when I start looking at these other late ones, you have 400 on the ice, 500 on the water... Uh, yeah, 600 on the earth, 850 on wind, and, and then, yeah, there's the meteor strike. So, I feel like, yeah, uh, there's definitely got to be another fire spell coming for Alicia that's going to be way bigger. I, I feel it in my bones. Combo flame sword. Byron, just smack it. Mika, you don't even use a poison arrow at this point, because it's already more than halfway dead in just one round of attacks. It's gonna die right now. That's that's all I got to say. Is it, it, it ain't it ain't gonna last. We're melting this frozen, the uh, spiky-haired hedgehog. Yeah, boom. There we go. And you recovered it. All right, let's go for some massive overkill. Boosh! Hell yeah! Boom! Some full restores and full potions. Always good. Always good. 
Okay, well that was taken care of. Is there anything I can do now that I've destroyed that? Because each of these quests usually gives me an item or at least something to, to work with. The the frozen land gave me not just an item, but uh, you know, a weapon, a ring, and a new person. So that so far that one's the one that uh, the quest that makes all the others look like uh, cheap, cheap things so far unworthy of its time. <laughs> uh, we are doing good here. Let's keep on trucking. What I would like to... Oh, hey, there's something here in the... Oh, okay, so there's this thing here in the past, but there's not anything here in the future. Excellent. Village of Namal. You're dead. Cool. It's locked. Are they all locked? I'm assuming they're all gonna be locked. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Nope, you're... Okay, these people are, like, all dead. That's... Oh, hey, I can go in the church. Nice. Is there, uh... Anyone here? Oh, yeah, there's a kitty. Oh, th the cat's the only one in here. Huh. Glom Gazingo? Meow. Glom Gazingo? What the hell is that? <laughs> Glom Gazingo, what? What is? Like, I'm sorry. What? I, well, well, it's not a. I'm. I'm so confused. This is, but this is hilarious. Okay, so a cat joined. It's not in the party list. Which is fine. I don't... I don't understand. I just... Oh my. Okay. Alright. So Glom Gazingo. Whatever that is. I... Oh boy. That cat is... Uh, has gotta be... A reference to something or someone that the developers know or something I don't wow okay well I've got a kitty I guess <laughs> okay locked and locked all right well let's take care of this portal the monster in it hey Hydra cool Alicia I don't know what the Hydra's gonna be weak to, so how about we try out that Hurricane Slash? Boom. John, you tell us what the Hydra's weak to. Stenobar, Hyper Barrier for everybody. Byron, just attack. Mika, go ahead and use a Toxic Arrow, why not? Let's see, let's see how it goes. I have a feeling that a Hydra may not be able to be poisoned whatsoever, but we'll see. Okay, so it's all physical, no magic attack, very and lower magic defense, uh, and it's just straight across the board. Cool. So, straight even across the board, no weaknesses or resistances. Boom! Wow, that was nothing. Alright, well, hey, it's been toxified, so we're good on that front. Good deal. Triple attack, whatever. Yeah, yeah you, oh, you can't even hurt John. Oh, because it's a Hydra, it's getting multiple attacks. Gotcha. Okay, uh -huh. I, I see. I pick it up what you're putting down. All right, well, let's Meteor Strike this Biznatch then, just because it's the most powerful thing we got. And Rage Mode, and Stenobar, die, Ice Blade, yeah, I want Ice Blade. Byron, you can, no, not the combo, ah, uh, oof, yeah, we, we, 18 more for the Rapid Strike, yeah, let's, let's, let's bide our time for that. And Mika, since it's already been toxified, just hit him with normal arrows. 
All right, unleash the oh. Well, so much for gaining TP, Byron. Meteor strike. Oh, that was good. That was good. I mean, for a thousand DP, that better be good. Ice blade. There we go. Ouch. Oh. Okay. Well, I mean, that's fine. Do whatever. It's, it's, it's fine. You. I mean, you're you're dead as it is. So. Uh. Okay. Special. Full. Cl oh, you don't have the technical points to full cleanse. Man. That sucks. Oh well. You attack. John's going to attack as well. Stinabar, just attack. Byron, you attack. Mika, you attack. Yeah, just do regular attacks all around, because this thing's not going to survive probably even just all these attacks, to be perfectly honest. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, there we go. Oh, well, that's fine. Arrow. Oh, wow. Wow, two attacks in a row missed. All right, Stenobar. Yeah, Stenobar did it. He took care of business. Woohoo! And a full restore. Excellent. Well, there goes that portal. Uh, Kitty, do anything for us? No. All right. Well then, let's go ahead and use a dispel herb to clear out that poison. Then we're gonna go take a trip to the. Uh, Dwarven lands so that we can go ahead and do free lodging. And with that in mind, guys, hey, we will go ahead and call the episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, go ahead and leave a like on the video and go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already so you can get more content like this because if you don't, I'll be sad. And more than me, Glum will be sad. Do you want a sad kitty? No, you don't. So, with uh, that all in mind, guys, hey, have a fantastic rest of your day. Leave a comment down below on what you think is going on with the cat, and we will give this new trek through time a great big... Oh my god, look at her! <laughs> Come back and see me, John. You know what? I like her candor. I like how forward she is here. Let's uh, let's give her, the innkeeper, a great big hell yeah.